the UK government has just confirmed that it is going to bring out 15 million pounds towards the international recruitment of care workers. Hello guys. The UK government has just confirmed that it is going to bring out 15 million pounds towards the international recruitment of care workers from 2023 to 2024. Yes, it is a huge one. And even though international recruitment is the main reason, this also applies to domestic people here. You know, people who are already in the UK looking for care jobs. Now it means that the funding also applies to you. This funding is going to go towards a lot of things to make the process way easier for international recruitment for people who are looking for jobs to come into the UK as care workers. So make sure you watch this video to the end so that you can know all about it. Uh, before we get into it, if you're new to my channel, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, leave your comments. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for staying on with me. Let's dive right in. So guys, this is a um from the announcement page on the web. I'll put link in the description box below. So this fund, it's fund for about fifteen million pounds that is going to go towards the international recruitment of adult and social care workers in the UK from twenty twenty three to twenty twenty four. You know, recently there's been a doubt whether the government still has interest in recruiting international care workers. But with this um, fund made available, it goes to show that really this um, shortage of staffing in the adult care sector is really in the government's mind. So this is the web um, page announcement. So the, the only areas I'd like to highlight is that the process is going to be done through the local authorities. You know, they will partner with local providers, with local care homes, with you know, residential care homes. They'll partner with them to actually apply for this um, fund then. So it's going to be, you know, very interesting to see how far this funding goes in making sure that international workers come in. The fund has already been launched on the 10th of February 2023. Deadline for the bid submission of all these regions with their care providers is 24th of February 2023. Payment is also going to be approved by 6th to 17th of March 2023. This Then the key timings for 2023 to 2024 funding, it's really it's something what I'm noticing as well because the deadline for submission of these bids will be on the 17th of March 2023. I mean, it's very close. We're already in February. Deadline of evaluation of the bids, you know, that won the people that won the funds is on the 24th of March 2023. And the payment as well will be approved by the 6th to 10th of April 2023. So the partnership, you know, it's very, 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 very interesting. And I'm so glad that it came up at this time when people were actually doubting what the future holds for them and their UK immigration plans. So um, this fund is going to go towards, you know, creating shared job boards, make it easier for people to apply for jobs. You know, it's going to help with the licensing or visa applications and pre-employment checks is going to also go towards you know supporting just care workers to come into the UK by booking their flights you know it's going to also go towards affordable accommodation options for people who come into the UK via this route um, it will help in the onboarding and induction process um, it's what um mentioning here that a lot of all these care homes when they give out COS, they actually have to pay for this in advance. So this money is going to really help cut down the cost in, on their own end. And all these people that, you know, tax, you know, uh, immigrants looking for jobs in the UK because of all these unnecessary expenses is going to curb all these unethical recruitment practices. 
their allocations will be according to regions, you know, in England. And depending on how much allocated, it will also affect how much uh, international recruitment is done. This is a really interesting update. And even though we haven't heard anything yet about the health and care worker visa, whether it's going to really come to an end on the 15th of February, 2023, but it's really um, an interesting update that the government is actually considering this um, um, making available funds to support international recruitment of care workers. So guys, this is the end of the video. Um, I hope this update helps, you know, so that you don't lose your zeal for your immigration plans to UK as a care worker or a support worker. My advice is continue searching, keep your ears, your ears down, you know, very soon we should be expecting to hear of more, more vacancies of uh, for international applicants for such jobs as the care assistants and care home, you know, carers. Hope this video helps.